Hello everyone, in this video we will investigate the refraction through the glass lab, lateral shift, factors affecting lateral shift and total internal reflection in glass lab. For this demonstration I have taken two glass labs of different thicknesses, a green laser light, black paper to view the laser light properly, in absence of black paper it would be difficult to see the laser beam in different background. After shining the laser light, we can clearly see the bending of light that is the refraction of light happening at the interface. Instead of light going straight, a shift is observed from its path which is known as lateral shift. In this picture, we can also see a very small fraction of light that undergoes partial reflection from the top surface of the glass lab. On lifting the glass lab up in the air, gives you a more clear picture of the things happening. We can very well see that the lateral shift depends upon the thickness of the glass slab. More the thickness, more is the lateral shift. By the way, the thickness is the perpendicular distance between two surfaces through which the light passes. It was wonderful to explore lateral shift with two glass slabs of different thicknesses. We can see that there is no bending of light taking place over here if the laser light is falling normally to the surface. It was interesting to see as the angle of incidence increased, the lateral shift also increased. If the laser light enters the glass slab and strikes its another perpendicular surface with an angle more than the critical angle, total internal reflection is observed. I hope you have enjoyed the demonstration. Thanks for watching the video.